Ah, uh, everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. Let's play some Roguelands. Here we go with some axe and mental model. Splash, splash, splash for offense. For defense, it's quick shields. Shields like a Neo Generator and Evolution. Could, could pay, maybe do something good for us. And some grenades. I, I mean, slag seems to be the way because I don't want to have to get all the way down into that left side tree if I don't have to. Okay, some fire damage is noise. And some splash damage or some shock damage is good too. Oh, a Hulk. Not the worst starting room I've ever seen. I got three good weapons already. Oh, a bandit launcher too. That's kind of nice with it. Ooh, what's that? A dart? I think the dart's a little slept on. little slept on. I think maybe we do dart it. Last thing I want to have, though, is just too much stuff. Okay, how about max ammo with a bunch of different weapon types? Oh, let's go. A longbow transfusion with a 0 0.7 fuse time. Jeez. And an amp shield? I mean... This could be this could be a good starting room for us. Now this these are two calipines that could both be good. This one has higher damage. All right, so let's check this out. Check this out. Let's make sure that we have. I think the sniper could be good. So could the fire SMG. Two assault rifles or two shock weapons. Let's stick with the the dart for now and let's hit pitter patter. Let's get at her. Five points. My I mean, my number one go to is impact for the gun damage and melee damage if we need it. All right, the bone yard. This should be fleshy enemies. Yep, we're not gonna need the sniper here at all. In fact, it's probably just gonna be SMG, maybe a little bit of Hulk action. All right, let's do it. All right, turret out. What do we got? A fossil skag and a barb pup skag. Okay, that's a much better class mod for this stage. What else do we got here? Oh, that's an okay grenadier. Go. Hey, nice. That's nice assault rifle. Maybe that could be good. The thing I just got, but... I'm not sure if I want to go it. I think we're good with what we got. Let's just do elemental matching. Wow, lots of enemies are dropping guns right now. That's the second time already. Hey, whoa, whoa. Chill out, brother. I don't have anything to slag quite yet. That's okay, though. Yeah, this thing is kind of ripping. The team fire rate class mods kind of go crazy. I've always wanted to try, like, a, a co-op build where everyone in the party goes the team base skills. So that way we're all just basically super soldiers. Throwing a transfusion grenade when I'm at full health and almost full shields is, is absolutely ludicrous, but here we are. Nice. Good first round. We can farm up the stage, too, pretty simply. That's a nice uh, SMG, but I have a better one already. This this blue fire mala one's kind of clutch with it. We're going to be hitting up both the secrets on this map as well. Got. Take that. I mean, I'm pretty sure that was that. How much ammo did that consume per shot? Four ammo per shot. That's got to be high damage, right? Early. And it looks sick. Let's try it out. All right, pressure plate me. Something decent here. I think I saw a pushka. We don't have anything corrosive damage yet. Let's take that. Spinning gun, maybe next time. Okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna, again, I, I'm very much prefer elemental stuff, just because I can elemental match. Which if, I mean, I'm sure you know, but if you don't, if you, I believe you get upwards of like 70% bonus damage just by, just by taking the right elemental matching. Just crazy talk. Like it's, it's a type of damage that you just can't, you simply cannot let go. It's a coach gun with a Hyperion grip. I'm not going to take it. We're going to get started here. Oh, we had a bit of a, a hiatus, but we're back now. Hope you all enjoyed that Salvador run. Let's see. Cooldown rate is nice. Reload speed and max size with some nice skills. Hmm. I mean, I just like the fire rate. I'm gonna stick with the one I got, I think. Gives me some good skills. I mean, kind of. I'm fine. I'm fine. I can just stick with the one I got. Let's go Metal Storm for that fire rate after getting a kill. That's just a really nice skill to have. The Washburn Refinery. Looks like we're gonna be swapping over to my Corrosive Damage. This is one of the hardest zones in the game, for sure. Let's strip shields with this. And then we can kill them with that. Any shielders? No shields quite yet. Alright, build the power loader. 
Thank you, Pushka, for your service. I want to destroy that barrel. Oh, do dodge, dodge, dodge. And I'm overwhelmed already. Yeah, this could be tough. Lots of transfusion out. They heal me up a bit. Looking good. Looking decent, looking decent. Hide real quick. Oh, the junk loader flanking me. He's trying to flank and gank. Well, I'm the one who flanks, brother. I want to thank this Pushka for helping us out. That, da that damage in this thing is kind of ridiculous. All right. Let this guy melee. That way he drops his spinnies. They're like General Grievous. Flash. So, yep, yeah, just let him melee. There we go. Now his left side is completely exposed. There. Nice. Junk loader. Left. Right. Center. Don't shoot me. Phew. Nice shot, brother. <clears throat> Run up here. Got two things to grab. Melee damage relic? No, thanks. Very clean. Clean stage so far. I don't think the Pushka. Nice. Okay. Frontline. Fathead veteran. Let's see. I mean, what we're really looking for that's a pretty nice class mod steady and last ditch effort i could make like an unkept herald something go crazy because the steady gives us the grenade damage scaling oh better shields I like this shield this adaptive let's go nice nice all right what do we got here Mm, no, I'm good without that. But yeah, having steady and last ditch effort could be nice because when you go down, last ditch effort gives you a bunch of extra gun damage. Don't think we need that with our with our sniper the way it is right now. Let's take one point in steady. That's gonna be super nice. No, I really feel like you don't need to go that much further down this tree most of the time. Let's just get our defense in order here. Just in case we start going up against some tougher enemies. Hater's Folly, yeah. Speaking of tougher enemies. There's not going to be any... Armored enemies here, I do not believe. So, or shielded. So let's just go with this fire SMG. Alright, toss down my turret. This guy, as this guy just completely shreds my entire shield. There we go. Come on, get me there. It's gonna be rabbit skag. Yep, rabbit skag. Uh oh. Okay. They're fast, they're tanky, and they do lots of damage. The three things that uh, NPCs are not allowed to be. Our enemies are Shinapi. In conjunction with each other. Okay, okay. I feel like if you're fast, this is coming from, if you have seen, have seen. I think his name is Pirate Software, or I forgot his name, but he's a popular content creator. My brother sent me a link to a, a discussion he had about enemy design. Like, if you're tanky, you shouldn't also be fast and do damage. Like, you're allowed to have two of the three. Tanky, fast, and damage. As soon as you have all three, it's like, that's bad enemy design. And rabbit skags are that. Now, their damage isn't insanely high, but it's high enough, trust me. Because they just stick to you. Like, they have to stick to you, which gives them that extra damage. Okay, see you later. I'm liking this fire rate. Yep. We're good. Good stuff, good stuff. We're, we're going to be grabbing both both the secrets on this map as well. Very nice. Go down, homie. Go down. I'll say this SMG is really kind of cooking. Good stuff. Take, maybe this be, this be a good time to use the Hulk because of the fact that uh, I have splash damage. We could give it a try. I think it's a, it's a Hyperion Grip Hulk. I'm not sure how good it's going to be. We can give it a shot. Not bad. 
not great, but not bad. Good stuff. One more kill here. We can farm the stage out. Very good. Oh, Vlad off? No thanks. Alright, five points. Let's take... I mean, it's our first bit of slag that we've gotten, so maybe we grab it. Last stitch. I think now's the time. We go last stitch effort, and we, this is when we swap our class mods. Steady and last stitch effort. Okay, so now I've got points in both these. If I go down, I get I get a bunch of extra movement speed and a bunch of extra damage, which is nice. Speaking of nice, I went to a casino for the first time this weekend, and. I <clears throat> I bet twenty total dollars at the roulette table. Twenty 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 dot total dollars, and I walked out of there with forty five, which is uh, pretty sick. So I made twenty five dollars, which was enough to pay for the, my meal. They say that the house always wins. Well, not this time, brother. Not this time. Actually, I played roulette and I did not lose a single time. I just either picked red or black, and I got it right seven times in a row and left. Something like that. I, I know I didn't lose. It was pretty nuts. He... Oh, is that going to be better than my... I, I just need to get my fire SMG out here so I can compare, please. Game. Oh, it's, I already have it out. I think it's just going to be overall better. Let's see the sight, though. Nice sight. Okay. Two Snyders. Snyders do splash. Maybe, maybe we do take... Maybe we do take. And having the cooldown reduction is going to be nice, too. Yeah, casinos are le legit. It was ridiculous how big it was. It was the Mohegan Sun. It's the second largest casino in the United States. And there was a lot of people there. Okay, very good. Do I see myself becoming addicted to gambling? No. Definitely not. It's not really my thing, to be honest with you. Alright, toss this bad layer down. Hey, don't flank me. No flanking. Yeah. This is a tough spot to fight because the sun's in your eyes. Let's destroy that barrel so I don't get killed. Go. The extra reload speed coming in handy there. The reload speed coming in handy here. Good stuff. Okay, toss a grenade out there. Not that it's going to do too much. I know that th there's definitely going to be armored enemies on this map, probably. Spiker, an aim shot. Hmm. Let's go over here. Oh, he's got shields. Let me just strip those shields real quick. Thank you. And we're back. There we go. Now it's just his flesh. Good. Any other shield enemies? Yeah. Trip those shields. Nice. Good job. Good job. Good job. All right. I'm going to grab... I'm going to use that candy for the boss. Even though the boss is immune to... The boss is immune to explosive damage. So maybe not. Where are you? Where'd you go? Oh. The other guy dodged, apparently, it looks like. Trip the shields. There we go. Good stuff. Can't see him. Come on, give me that. Sh give me that weapon. There we go. Did it. We did it. We're here. Push a little bit. He doesn't do much melee damage. Good. I can get a grenade from here that doesn't do explosive damage. Nope. We're gonna. We're gonna want that slag. Grab these and then just. Just scared of all the other enemies. Let's just. That's a bunch of nades. There we go. Good stuff. Somebody running over there. Good. Yeah, these lunatic bombers gotta go before I have a chance to kill Oni. Go. Oh, Oni did die. Crazy. Okay, we live. Nice job, Transfusions. I appreciate you. Slayer Terramorphous class mod is yucky. 1340, also yucky. Hmm, coach gone, no thanks. No, we are going to want to shoot some oil cans, though, because... 
We're looking for better grenades and better shield. Our grenade is good for now, but... A slag transfusion is always better. Here we go. Let's see. No grenadier, which is tough. Okay. All right, let's jump here. Jump here. Good stuff. All right, oil can number two. That reload speed feels so nice. One game at the casino that I would that I would actually really like to play is poker of some sort. Because every time I have played poker, it's gone pretty well. Oh, you already got that one. Nice. Where's that last one? Okay, it's right here. Pop. Yeah, what do we got? Mm, turtle shield. Maybe a turtle shield is the way. 2.36 to the 2.3 million. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think that's going to be a better shield for us. I kind of like the... Turtle shields on Axon. Okay, let's go. I mean, we're not getting that much. Besides recoil reduction, we're not getting that much from Steady for now. But let's just, I don't know. Let's prepare ourselves for the future. Okay. Let's go next. Assassin only died to explosive damage right there. <laughs> whatever, whatever you consider transfusions, to be honest with you. Alright, so this is going to be a tough fight. The Pushka is going to come in handy. My only crossbow damage weapon. I should have grabbed the other one while I could, but... It is what it is. Alright, run for my life. Let's go get to the cheese spot. I, I don't think we can... I don't think we can do this fight regular. I think we got to cheese him a little bit, maybe. I have light up in my face. Okay, here we go. Let's grab some... Maybe open up some loot while we're here, see if I can get a crossbow damage weapon. Is that better than mine? It is in every statistical category. Okay. Bring it on. I think. Well, let's, just, let's just use crit spy. Is that it right there? I think. Is it his hinges? His groin? Doesn't look like it. But right there. No. Nope. But his health is, is already pretty low. Let's just a turret down. Maybe soak up some deeps for us. Here we go. Metal Storm coming in. I'm almost out of blammo, though. What is this guy's crit? Is it his lights? Doesn't look like it's his lights. Here we go. Alright, hold me. Ow. 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 Oh, we need to toss, toss transfusions. I can't die here. Transfusion out. Come on. Good stuff. Thank you. Appreciate that. Duck in and out. This would be nice to have Salvador on my team for some team bullet regeneration. Looking okay. Let him let him get this attack out of the way. Oh my gosh, it's hitting me. Transfusion grenades, transfusion grenades. Come back to me. Thank you. Good. Thank you, Hulk, for helping me out here. Give me that reload speed. Thank you. Not so bad. Metal Storm me. What's nice is that after killing those little guys on them, you get that Metal Storm proc, which is going to increase your fire rate by a bunch. Here it comes. I need to back up just a tiny bit here. Oh, all this... It's not like he's actually getting... Yeah. All the, all the the bridge above him. Saturn, this is your location. You don't even know the terrain, brother. It's embarrassing. Dealer. Okay. Drop me anything good? No, nope, that's not good at all. Hopefully this, uh... This Christmas present over here has, has something decent. All right, come on, Joel's dude, hit me up. Let's see, a Morning Star, a teapot. I mean, the hive is always nice, but more for like when you're fighting Saturn. I, 
don't think the Morningstar gets splash damage. Maybe the teapot does. I'm gonna do some googling to see, you know. Let's, I'm gonna do some googling to see if, if these things get splash damage scaling. Okay, so the teapot does do splash damage, which makes it a, a theoretical better weapon for me than the the pushka that it has been doing very very well. The morning star does not do splash. The deadly bloom, however, be a very interesting option for us because it it's every time it gets depleted or you enter fight for your life, it explodes and it doesn't have to recharge. And, I mean, with our shield skills, I think, I mean, it could be funny. Uh, let's just, let's just see. You know, let's just give it a shot. Hmm. The Razor Gatling gun could be good. Okay, so. Let's take last ditch effort, maybe? Honestly, it's too hard to... What I kind of want to do is take five points into Battlefront. And they get down to resourceful. And just have two nukes. Could be good. Pretty sick, pretty sick. Now the one thing that uh, is a little bit tricky now is that I have... I have a hive. As well as... Uh, different kinds of launchers. But this launcher, it, it really is only strong... Against, you know, heavy armored items. Or heavy armored enemies, I'm pretty sure. I could give it a shot. Lob slag transfusion. I think that's gonna... I think it might outperform my current. Give me some source of slag. And it can heal us. The fuse time is a little bit longer, but... That's okay. Alright, so with our iridium, let's... Yeah, what is it? Okay, plasma casters do splash damage. That's going to be a better fire option than anything I've got right now. For Terra, if I get Terra, that'll be my number one. Let's take it. All right, what do you got for me? The Slaga is redonkulous on me. I feel like. Let's take it. All right, pull. Yes, Hector's Paradise. Okay, even better. Let's go. Deliverance. Could be okay, I think. Alright, one more pull. Come on. Not Slayer. Legendary Soldier. Okay, let's do Legendary Soldier then. And we can also get a, a respec in here, just to make sure that we're ma making use of the Legendary Soldier class mod. Alright. Let's just go one point wonders in each of these. Very good skills across the board. But this one gives... What? This one gives six? One, two, three, four, five. That's ridiculous. Ridiculous. You just go 11 out of 5 everything. Is that not insane? Right, let's go 11 out of 5 here and 11 out of 5 here. No, I see. It's... it's. Oh yeah, it's only 5 points, not 11 out of 5. Only 10 out of 5. Okay. Uh, for a raid boss, do I really want to kill? Oh, let's before I do all my respect, let's see what raid boss we get. That way, I'm just not, I'm not guessing. Okay, so it's power repeat. So the the kill skills will matter here. It will matter. Weapon swap speed and aim speed is important. Increase my max health. I think is good too. Reload speed. The turret's gonna get its the turret's gonna get beat down. How about we do willing? Oh wow, I don't I don't have as many points as I thought I did. You know what? I don't think it's worth I don't think it's worth spreading out my points all that much quite yet. I think I just wanna take impact. One point preparation. Battle storm. Steady. Good. I think that's good. Now Let's get our Yeah, let's get our defense up a little bit here. Yeah, that's good. Very strong. Our shields will be up all the time now. Hopefully. Mm. One point in healthy could could be okay, I think. One point in expertise. And one point in century. I think yeah. Let's do that. 
And for our primary weapon, it's going to be Slaga into Hector's Paradise. Hector's Paradise gets splash damage, which is nice. Not going to need a teapot. Yeah, this, this third weapon isn't really going to be used, so let's just get it out of our inventory. There we go. Just like that. Should be strong. All right, come on, Pete. Peter, what's up, homie? Good stuff. Good. His shields are getting evaporated now. Okay, here comes his first... His first bit of, you know... Angry. Very, He's very upset. Go. Thank you, Hector's Paradise. For all these lads. And it, if these guys can drop you something really good... That's good. That's good Pete damage right there. Oop. Get a re-slag. Holy, my slag timings are all out of this world. Okay. Eat this, homie. Oh, he did hit me with that. Shoot. Okay. Oh, how about a little bit of slag for your lat? There we go. Looks like my shield's actually regening between. Oh, come on. Let me use my headshots. There we go. Good stuff. Slag. Thank you. Not bad. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't charge me, bro. Alright, let's get some spider rants out here. I'm almost out of ammo, too, so. Hit up this. Hit up this. All right, get the spider rounds out here. Drop me a power up, would you? I just don't feel like he's gonna be able to to down me if I don't get close to him. So, oh, that was insane. Oh, do I have another weapon I can use? That'll be good for me here. For shock damage, not really. I can try this dart. I can try to do one-shot reloads with the dart. Maybe. Oh, I'm out of I'm out of pistol ammo. It's not gonna work. Skull masher. How's that doing? Can't tell if that's doing very much. I don't know. Slag him up. You you debuff me. I just cleanse it asap. Power up me. Put some ammo regen. Mm, from or I mean a green power would go. Oh don't don't punch me. Punch is the only thing I'm scared of. That's gonna be. I think that's gonna be good for me. Let's see. Ammo regen and fire rate. Yeah, let's take it. And switch back to my Hector's Paradise, obviously. Yeah, let's just get as many mags as we can down range. Flag them. Good damage, good damage, good damage. That's why we play it. That's why we play for the power ups. And getting power P out of the way is going to be a huge, huge for us. Ah, the blammo. That's not good. Put this bad boy. He's trying to. He's trying to charge me. Again, I don't have confidence that power people put us down at all. What's that? Give me some of that pistol on if you would, brother. Okay. Go ahead. No, he debuffed me and immediately the waterfall went away. I stuff. Eat this. Okay, you give me cleanse. You. 157 rounds is good. And just slag. All of you can go. Metal storm is good stuff. Kill these lads. 
There we go. No power ups though. Crazy. Dang it. I always get to but Fred's the waterfall goes away. Okay. You're going down, Peter. You're going down. I'm yelling, Peter. You better move. You know what I'm saying. All right, here we go. You guys are getting pretty beefy. As beefy as Peter himself, though, obviously. Hey, yeah, I can one-shot them. Not a big problem. All right, I don't think we ever even lost our shields. If we did, it was just for a, a little bit of time. A bladed tattler. I'm gonna have to check to see if it does splash, but I don't see it being that phenomenal. Punchy? No, thanks. Oh, flacker. Okay, that could be good. It could be definitely be good. Get the right bosses. That could go crazy mode. Crazy mode. The evolution shield. I think. If, if we're being real with ourselves, I think the Evolution Shield goes in to replace what we got going now. Good stuff. Okay, so the Flacker, if I can get some Flacker swaps with some Torg Rocket Launchers. I think that could be good. Let's pick up that Blade of Tattler. And we can press. Let's continue on. Thanks, Power Pete. Decent round, decent loot. Oh, trivia time. This is me. It's always been me. Okay, what does Cop Trap commonly refer to as minion? I see a handsome looking minion. Okay, how many playable characters are there in Borderlands 2? Six, which is crazy that they didn't add more to other games. What legendary can Wilhelm drop? Wilhelm drops the Logan's gun. That's three for three. Do I get something crazy? No. <laughs> Whether you get them right or wrong doesn't matter. It's okay. They made an entire trivia mod based off the same zone and everything like that. At this point, would I swap to a Grenadier class mod? I don't really think so. I kind of like the Legendary Soldier. Especially because I thought it had a special effect. But it's just really nice to have so many of these skills. Access Tier 1 skills are nuts, so... This is the moment of truth. I think we... I am full. I have to drop some stuff. See you guys in a second. Are oh, you already? Boom. That was cool. All right. So let's take it. I, I I don't know if I should or not. It's just a really tough call. It's a good class mod. It is a good class mod. Okay. What you got for me? More class mods. It's a fun zone. I throw the throw the turret down there. Okay, Anchorman, you just don't want to take any damage, huh? Okay, maybe we do swap to a to a plasma caster here. Hey, stop! Thank you. You're gone. Slag and swap. Good stuff. We're gonna run out of SMG ammo here, though, pretty quickly, it feels like. Let's see. Oh, we got... I mean, I feel... Whoa, chill out, brother. Let's swap over to the other class mod and see if that just... How much more that does it... Oh, man. It feels like a lot better. In the damage department, it feels a lot stronger. Yeah, it does feel a lot stronger. Holy cow. Let's grab this. You can move on. punched oh and the bladed <laughs> the blade feels nice yeah yeah the grenadier class mod just i don't know it's just pumps so much deeps yeah you get the splash damage weapons with this this class mod like holy smokes man nice Oh, yeah. I toss a grenade out. Okay, I toss a shield. I toss a turret. 
Oh man, I went down. Kill the super badass. Nice. Okay, that's my first down of the game, I think. It looks clear. It's not so bad. Wow, that's a lot. Yeah, realistically, I think this could be better. Could definitely be better. The splash damage was crazy mode. Anything good here now? Nah. Okay, so next five points, I mean... I think five out of five preparation is just D's. I do like nukes. Hmm. Onslaught's good too. Let's take Onslaught. And move on. Didn't, did not take the time to see if there was anything I missed there, but that's okay. Oh my gosh, see you later. Holy cow. I'm, I'm in the middle of the open. I need to just grab some cover real quick. Evolution shield helping me out quite a bit right now. Accent and the Hector's Paradise are just a match made in heaven, honestly. One of my favorite weapons on him. He can, he can speed up that, that dull slow fire rate. And he makes use of the splash damage like crazy. Enemies with shields just get absolutely ripped. Huge. Okay. Thank you, Turret. Mm, no, I'm good without that. And we're looking for a Torg launcher to pair with my Flacker. That can help us against certain bosses. Nope. And if I need slag, I've got slag, so I feel like I don't need slag turrets. If you got the slag, I don't think I don't think you need slag turrets at all. I think a respec is in order here. Because we're, we're I think we're gonna stick with Grenadier class mod. We just take these. That's it. And then we go over to this side. Reload speed. Shield regen. Onslaught. That's it for now. Preparation. Pressure. There we go. Make use of all three of Axe and Skill Trees, I feel like, is the way to go. It's just strong overall. Let's see. Deputy's badge. And Sheriff's Badge. Let's go Sheriff's Badge. Let's go. Now we're talking. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, don't do that. Okay. Having the extra pistol damage is going to go not-so mode. Not so mode. It's now base. Without even Metal Storm or Onslaught, we just get rapid fire. Okay, what do we got? Diamond policy, a horror show. We're gonna want something in case our in case our Hector's Predator runs out of blammo. Southern shelf. This should be an easy stage, hopefully. And I probably don't need to use the shock damage pistol here, but I don't want to for Fonzies. Here we go. Nice, nice. Yeah, we also have the... Oh, yeah, we have the shotgun damage. For the flacker, if we want it. I'm not going to use the flacker against normal enemies. This is... Nah, I guess I could give it a shot. Don't get me wrong. I'll give it a shot. But this, it really just works better against larger enemies. I should have used it against those bully monks before I used it against these humans, but let's just see. We st step back a little bit, see if that kills. See, like, even if you even if you do land, like, a shot or two, this doesn't kill. Which is the crazy part to me. If I land that with Axe, then they should both be dead. I bet there should be no survivors. It's just me. Okay. That, that That's crazy how they survived to me. Like, that is absolutely ludicrous. 
which is why it's good for doing some swap shenanigans, but not so good for other things. Just like random, you know, mobbing. It's, again, it, it's really good against big enemies, not small ones. Okay, keep it moving. Five more points. I'm going to go down this right side skill tree, I think. Let's do... I like failing shield. Let's get some shields going. Again, shield shield tanking on action is the way. What you got? Sticky homing slag bouncing Betty with a 3.2. Okay, but I kind of like what I got going now, to be honest with you. Let's see. Plus six Grenadier, plus five Steady. No. The only thing I would replace with it, the only thing I would like now is plus six Steady, plus five Impact. Extra shot chance. If we are going to go like a Hive or something. Let's just go next. What do we get? Okay, some more Assassins, but it's not going to be Oni. We already got through Oni. It's good. Not a Torg Launcher. Miss me with that then. Hey, you guys. See you later. Easy. I cost that out. Let's get some slaggity slag going. Swap down. Good stuff. Good. Alright, so I'm gonna I'm gonna jump down here. First let's grab this mask. Did I make it? I actually didn't make the jump. That's crazy. Come on. Jump. Now, I'm not against swapping back to the Legendary Soldier class mod if, you know, the run puts me that direction. Like, my splash damage isn't doing anything. But we saw, like, how much more damage I had. With the, with the you know, the Grenadier class mod. Okay. That being said, the defense from the Legendary Soldier probably goes crazy. Might be better for, better off with dragons doing it that way. Good job, turret. Thank you. Oh, the, the boss is spawning, I feel like? Yeah, it is. Oh, they got slagged. So that's good stuff. Whoa! Nice try. Oh, nice try. The fact that we're able to get through this guy is good. Oh, see you later. I wonder what he... Can he does he get stuck down there? He might. Alright, let's just leave him down there. And I feel like they don't really drop me much loot anyways. Use this cover. Let's see. I want to swap to my fire, uh, my fire damage weapon. Okay. Is it a doll? Oh, it's a doll plasma caster. That's kind of ass. Yeah. Holy cow! What a low roll on the doll plasma caster, actually. Okay, we're gonna get this guy. Okay, he's down. What did you drop me? A Fremington's Edge. I don't think that does splash damage, but I'll look it up real quick. Let's see. Nothing there. Just the last mask. Realistically, we're just looking for a better grenade. Okay, I mean, a Singularity. We don't have one yet, so let's grab one. Let's go see if the Fremington's Edge does splash damage. Be right back. Okay, so the special characteristic of the Fremington's Edge is that it has a super duper zoom. Look at that zoom. Holy cow. I keep it around just for that, but realistically it doesn't, it doesn't do splash, so. Let's go back into this right side tree. Quick charge me. Resourceful. Let's keep going. 
Rocket destroy more enemies that require, you know, splash damage, but maybe a flacker could do something. Well, they're too fast for flacker, I think. You guys would need I need fire damage for these laddies, but I don't really have it, so let's just use this. Okay. They're not that tanky. Th their tankiness comes from reviving when you destroy one of them. Okay. Excuse me, don't punch me. Hey, don't punch me. I gotta be, I gotta be really careful now. I gotta be really, really careful. Yep, I don't see any other enemies around. Hey, let's get, go get the other one down. Hey, you guys. What's up? What's up? What's up? Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, I might go down here. Yep, definitely going down. Definitely going down. Shoot. If I, if I drop one of them down to below... Will the run end? Come on. No, why'd you run so far? Oh gosh, no, no, no. Nice, I'm alive, I'm alive. Holy brother. No, come on. Give me a second to breathe. We're good. I'll go for the revive. There we go, they're both down. Run for my life. Okay, not an easy fight, not an easy fight. But we live. What is that? Nope. Anything unique? Oh, an Avenger. Okay, okay. Oh, a new skin. Never gotten this before. Very cool. Unlucky in love. Maybe I'll slap that on. Okay. Alrighty. Let's see. What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? See a lot? No. Did I run on the wrong relic? I and mean, this one's just straight up better. That's good stuff. A Doc's Tidal Wave? Oh, a Shock Pimper now. Holy cow. Okay. Wait, is that Law and Order? No, just two Laws. Okay. Take a Doc's Tidal Wave. Take a Pimper now. Does the Pimper now do splash damage? Let's go find out. Okay, so the Pimpernel doesn't get splash damage bonuses, but that doesn't mean it's going to be bad. Actually, it's one of the best snipers in the entire game. I mean, the, the blade's a little bit unlucky, but... With the Legendary Class mod, I don't need to necessarily go splash. Where's this puppy over here? Nope. Okay. Not a bad round. Five points into this right side skill tree. Give me some grit so I don't go down. All right, Sanctuary. I think... I think I might hit the box. All right, what do you got? Legendary Point Man? Legendary Ranger? Like, it's too hard to... For me, it's too hard to know, like, these class mods. Like, you have to have a degree in bioengineering or something like that to... actually know what the heck you're doing. Let's see. Okay, that's a... It's an uncapped herald, which is a very, very nice. Another Hector's Paradise. I think with all things being the way they are, I think we just increase our pistol. And our sniper. I was hoping to get potentially a, a Torg rocket launcher, but that's okay. Let's head out. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Wham, bam, island. This is going to be fine for our weapons. We'll swap out to our Legendary Soldier class mod when we have to here. Okay. slag a -jama. Okay, he slagged. No crits, though. That's tough. The dude, this guy resists explosive damage, so it's going to be nice to have something that's not explosive damage here. Let's see if a Pimpernel can do, do me some work. I swear this guy blocks everything that comes out of his crit spots. Yeah. There we go. Good stuff right there. Come on. Can't hit him. Dang. Let's see how much the Unkept Herald does. I know this guy resists... This guy resists explosive, but let's just see. 
still eh, it doesn't do that much all right five shot back Burn out there we go going into his defense mode now let's rock i think i think uh slagger should be good enough for now maybe I don't want to be using I don't want to be using all pistols if I can help it. Maybe an Avenger. Go down, homie. Go. Is the Avenger what does it do? Regular bullet damage? Oh wow, that's just, wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. Wait, what? It's so wait, it's not doing ridiculous. I thought it was maybe doing ridiculous damage there for a second. Hey, don't don't let them evolve. Don't let me evolve. There we go. Let's get, let's get this guy some grenade tosses and see what happens. Here we go. Oh, okay, I'm down. <laughs> that didn't work. I'm in trouble. If I don't get a kill here. I'm in trouble. Okay, I'm good. Here we go. Thank you for this bandit launcher. It's never failed me yet. He goes up, which means I'm not going to hit him just for a bit here. Dang, man. Tough fight. Give me those crits. Maybe we do go for some slag. I'm not too sure. It's just too hard to keep him slag because it just goes away instantly. grenade out you gotta go man oh so annoying like this avenger with it with this build should like wipe out all these enemies but this just doesn't they just live that's the craziest part like, the avenger's so good avenger's so good no that one just lives not so good honestly this could be the end of the round honestly if, if i don't start doing more damage here okay Come on. Come on, get me there, get me there. How's he not into invincibility phase yet? I'm trying to focus on the boss, but... There we go. No way. I got, I got options. But I'm not going to have options here in a second. Holy cow, I'm on fire. No! Go down, go down, go down. Thank you. Please stop evolving. Go. Good. I need something. I need, I don't know. I need something. Volcano, maybe? Okay, you resist immediately. Oh, that's right. You got armor. This thing is not pumping. Oh, gosh, man. Um, where's my hive? I guess we'll just go to the yeah, hive, and maybe even the shotgun could be good. Go with the hive for now. That, that should go out and kill these guys. Shouldn't have a problem with that. Yeah, see, by the time I get my actual weapon out, it just doesn't do anything. Go. Okay. Stop back. Later. Go. Slag him. No. Yeah, I, I think I basically got the two hardest enemies to fight for my raid bosses, which is a typical action run. Can't make it easy on me. 
obviously. Okay. Doing okay. We're doing okay. Not not doing phenomenal, but we're doing okay. Some damage down. Good. There we go. Invincibility phase finally. He's gonna heal up. Which is tough, but. And they can't use Uncapped Herald because this guy resists. down. Thank you. I gotta check the Detectors Paris to see if the other one does better. All right, what do we got here? Yeah, it's actually way higher damage. Okay, let's just use this one instead. <laughs> it's got a funny sight too. That's funny. A little enemy. A little enemy. Stop hitting me. Thank you. What do you got for me? What is it? Can't see it. Legendary Point Man? I mean, I'm sure it's good, but... I cannot. The current moments. Pop down. No crits right there. That's my problem with this boss. That I'm aiming right at that crit spot and like just don't get any crits. Even when like when there's nothing blocking me. Gosh, come on you guys. Okay. Seems to be this the ticket though. There's two quick swaps and then pray. Finally, I can get a turret out to maybe tank up some aggro for me. And now these guys are both slagged up, which means they should go down pretty quickly here. Guys, so gonna go up, he's gonna go down, up and down. Won't that happen? Good. Oh yeah, here we go, finally. I think this guy might drop soon. Slag. Toss. Oh my goodness, it's getting close. Look at that slag. That slag did not last more than, I don't know, maybe a second. Okay. Out of that zone. Okay, or knock me back into it, homie. There we go. Holy. Okay, you better drop me something good. This guy never drops me anything good, man. Ever. What's that? It's an okay weapon. It's just not... It's not an accident weapon. Okay. Okay, we don't... The last legendary point, man... I can see it being decent against Dragoons, but other than that, I don't see it being that good. What do we get from here? An evolution or an antagonist? Uh, the, the antagonist is good, but the my issue with it is... Is that... I already have... I got decent slagging already with my slagger. That's what it's useful for. But meanwhile, the evolution is just like way better against the dragons. The dragons, a lot of their damage comes from damage over time. So if I'm going to beat him, I think the evolution is my go-to. And that one just had, you know, decent stats, so. Nope. Mm, nope. Nope. Borg Launcher. Borg Launcher, good sir. Or ex an explosive damage relic would be nice too. Doesn't seem like we're gonna get it. Okay, let's go. Tier 3. Alright. Climb, 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 climb. Fifth reach. I mean, it's gonna be a little bit rough. We're gonna have to be slagging most enemies, I think. Now, Just lots of slag and swaps. Lots of lots of slag and swaps for sure. 
Okay, we're good. Now we're... We are going to be able to use the Uncapped Herald, which is going to be nice. And we don't have to worry about Oni. We don't have to worry about Cromorax. So all the really big explosive damage resisting enemies are not going to be resisting anymore. The Tidal Wave, I feel like, is one of my favorite shotties. I like that. I do want to look up the Tidal Wave to see if it's got anything... Um, it's got anything fancy up up its sleeve but for now let's go into this area prepped with a slaga with an unkept herald unkept herald is torg right yeah it is torg um and Something for armor. I mean, the hive is good for armor. Maybe just a maybe my bandit launcher that I like. Okay, let's go. Alright, let's see. We're gonna be fighting in Firestone. An all time great. Slag and swap. Okay, we're gonna be need I think we're gonna be doing that for most of our kills here. Okay, he's slagged. Now we swap. Good. You slagged yet? Not yet. Isn't it gonna matter? No, not really. Don't think so. Go down, homie. Deal. Can't see much. We're fighting into the sun. Okay, slag. Swap. That's actually really good damage. I mean, loaders are specifically susceptible to the uncapped herald because of the way the bullet spread is. It's really nice. Um, I don't need a fire burst at this point, honestly. I swap. The only person that the fire burst is really going to be effective against is that. Oh, pressure pad. Found it. I hit these guys both up. Oh, turret out. Got turret out. Yeah, we're good. Never mind. Turret, we're fine. Pressure pad in here that I didn't know existed. Oh, let's go. Org launcher. Huge. Toothpick. Mouth wash me. Avenger. You missed me with that, bro. Let's see. A homing bonus package. I think could be really good for clearing out areas. Okay. Sorry, Avenger. Look, like, listen, Avenger. I, I, I respect your game, but I don't respect your game, bro. It's nothing to get nothing personal, kid. Like when the baby maker exists or something like that. I feel like the Avengers just trash mode. Trash mode. Not good at all. Well, now we're starting to get the real rewards. Holy cow. Tier three. So insane. Alright, grip me. Two turrets is always naz. Two longbow and sticky. My two look at the weapon combination. And then battlefronts up next on the docket. Good stuff. Looking for a Borderlands symbol because now that I have toothpick, mouthwashes of the utmost import. SMG damage, assault rifle damage. Good stuff. Good stuff. Uh, take. I'm already full though. Dang it. Borderlands symbol me. Dang. I do want to look around for a little bit just to see if I can find it in this map. I'll be right back. Okay, so I didn't find it, but that's okay. We're moving on. There was a shock, you know, gate that I could have tried to push through, but. And then the damn con chilling. All right, let's see. Hit him with up with this. Yeah, okay, can't hit a single shot on this guy. There we go. Now we've got our kill skills, so we can maybe keep it moving here, keep the pressure up. Hey, where are you going? Oh, wow, one shot. The bonus package out there. Run away, run away, and I'm down. I should be fine, though. No? Yeah, I'm fine. Bonus package just got chill out, chill out. All right, I know where the Borderlands symbol is in this map, so that's gonna help us out right there. Plus some bonus packages, bonus packages, anchor man, bonus package, a lot of grenades. This should soften these guys up pretty good. Turret out, second turret out. 
two turrets is a noise. And they, they soak up aggro. That's a big part of what the turrets are useful for, is soaking up aggro. And when it comes to soaking up aggro, two is most certainly better than one. How about this Hudden Kept Herald? Holy cow, brother. Not even double penetrating. Jeez Louise. All right. What do we get? Sheriff's badge and incendiary damage. Nope. Not for me. All right, let's see. The, uh, the buffalo apparently is like one of the highest damage weapons in the game. Really interesting. Really interesting. All right. Five more points. We're going to go into Battlefront. And I, I do like expertise for the... Because we're doing slag and swaps mostly. Well, we, we were planning on doing slag and, slag and swaps until we realized that we don't need to at all. I'm here. Pretty decent zone for us, though, all things considered. It's one of the first times in a long time that I haven't just seen random quads just around for me. Okay. Let's keep it moving. Lynchwood. Okay. Don't get hit by a train. Do not let the train end. Okay, no, there's no train here. Good. Okay, get slagged. Okay, he's immediately just gonna do that attack. He's pretty just gonna find a grit though. Great helping us out a ton there. Yeah. Okay, who's shooting at me? Plus grenades. Slag him. I wanna thank the bonus package for helping us out here. Cleaning up some kills. Boom, 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 boom. Hey, you stop that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You go ahead. Go through that wall, homie. Oh, no. I need one turret. I need a second turret. Don't mind. Thank you. Oh, that's not good at all. Okay, we're okay, though. Big damage coming out. Onslaught and Metal Storm. Oh, yeah. It's such huge damage from those two skills, man. Like that, once the kill skills kick in, you're like, oh my gosh, like, accidents damage is ridiculous. Yeah, a ruby is good. I don't know how much, I mean, people always tell me to, like, do... People always tell me to rock an unkept herald and then use a ruby. What I could do is... Give me that ruby. Where's it at? People always tell me to, to shoot and swap. That's really hard to do. Shoot swap. To do it fast enough? It takes the same finger on my on my mouse. So I could do something like shoot swap. Like Oh, it's just not good. Shoot swap. Yeah, it's just so hard to get it right. So hard. Let's go next. I should have grabbed a borderland symbol back there. I know where it is too, but. It is what it is. I toss you. I mean, the initial damage isn't so insane. Once we get going here, it really ramps up. Okay, jump up here. Destroy these two slag barrels so I don't die. One turret. Oh, I forgot it's longbow. Longbow nukes too. Yeah, nice. Good stuff. I want to get wrecked. Go ahead, get rocked. Incinerator Clayton already. What's up, homie? My kill skills activated because my bonus packages are out there doing their thing. There you go. He goes down. Now he's got the rest of these jokers. Guy's aiming at my turrets. He doesn't realize that I'm the threat. Oh, that hurt. Anything can kill me now is definitely barrels. That can most certainly do damage to me. Yep, 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 yep. Relax, relax, relax. Can't see, but they're gonna die. Okay, see you later. Good stuff, good stuff. Go down. Yes, yeah, big, 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 big. Okay. 
Legendary point man, legendary ranger. Nah, I think the grenadier is, is nice for us. Yeah, the weapon swap though. Extra grenades. How about, we, how about we just do ranger? Better at everything. Slightly better at everything. Alright, Captain Flint. Let's go, homie. Matchstick, nope. I've seen I've had him spawns the loot matchstick once before, so now I always check. Shock damage goes kinda crazy, but not but not crazier than my pistol, I don't think. Oh, let's go. Oh, you guys wanna fire at me? Go ahead. Eat, eat some nukes. Nice reclaim. Did they soften him up just enough? Good. The extra movement speed from Onslaught and the gun damage. The fire rate. It's just everything comes in so clutch here. The collect no matter what I do, no matter how quick I am, it feels like there's just no way to heal up with the Ruby and the Grog. No way at all. There we go. Oh, who's behind me? But I'm gonna try to do a one shot on this guy with the flacker. I think he's big enough that can make it work. Go down, homie. Okay, so let's try this. Let's go flacker. And then Tunguska. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna shoot the flacker and swap to Tunguska. First we slag. Okay. Shoot, shoot and swap. Mm, not so great. Not so great. Shoot swap. Mm, nope, not so great. Again, shoot swap. A little bit slow. It's too hard. What if I use two different fingers, though? Nope. We need to shoot first. Shoot swap. Shoot swap. Nope, it's just not working. Just not, just not working for me. Okay. In that case, in that case, we just uncapped Harold it. Whoa, 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 no, 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 no. Nuke him. Thank you to the nukes. Oh yeah, the uncapped Herald's ridiculous, man. Okay. Max health and grenade bonuses for a short time. It's not going to be helpful for us. Not going to be that helpful. What you got for me? Volcano, no thanks. Stoic Emperor, no. The Beast Shield. Neo generator is good too, man. But shock conference call. I think I th I've oh man, so many good things. So let's just drop some stuff that we're never gonna use. Um, deadly bloom. Sorry, that evolution. Sorry. Transfusion is probably better than the homing bonus package for sure. There are so I've got so many class mods, it's ridiculous. Don't need all those. Deputy's badge, not gonna use it. Mm. Let's see, teapot, not gonna use. Should be fine for now. Let's grab this B shield and head out. It's a nice conference call though. It's got tour grip, not not a matching grip though. Where's that be? Take it. And go. Alright, Sanctuary. Let's grab some more Grenages. More pistol ammo. I think I'm capped, though, on pistol. What is that? Maybe not. Yeah, what do you got? The Baruch, which I like, and Sludge of Shotgun, which I like, too, but not that much. A Nor fleet would go crazy here. Oh, no, another uncapped herald. I think it's worse than my own. Okay, an ogre. An ogre could be good. Let's drop this flacker. Never gonna use that trash. Yeah. Ogre could be good. Do I survive the dragons with this build? Probably not.
Probably not. I think what we might have to do is we might... We might have to rely on, say, let's do a legendary... Legendary point man sounds good. Doesn't give me extra points in preparation, though. But this is going to help us defensively so, so much. So, so much. I think it's worth to give it a try. Let's respec into it. Focus up and get the red skills here. Preparation. Pressure. Last ditch efforts. It's, it's a muscle take for Barons here. We don't need... I don't think we need anything like that. How about Grit? Here we go. Impact. Metal Storm's not that important. Yeah, it really isn't that important, to be honest with you. I don't even need to take it. I know that I, I can activate both my kill skills by throwing my turrets down. But realistically... This, is, this fight's just about staying alive. Quick charge. No. Forbearance. Grit. Two turrets. And honestly, yeah, maybe the, the Phalanx Shield would be good too. Impact. Expertise. Steady. Do or die. Reload speed, shields. Yeah, this is going to be good stuff. More Grenages. Turrets last longer. Now we're talking. So two turrets that both slag. Mm. And extra damage while my turrets are up. And a little bit of cooldown reduction, I think, will be good. Okay, I think that, that'll be strong enough for this fight, to be honest with you. Hopefully, we do not die. And for our grenades, we're going to go... This lob slash transfusion. And we're going to activate this defense shrine ASAP. Alright, Axe, then. We got this. This is our fight. Only two Iridium for this. Alright, where's blue at? Wait, where's blue? Where's blue? Where's blue? There he is. Get blue down here. Come on down to the price is right. Mike. Give me some slag and give me some crits. Come on, come on. It's not terrible damage, to be honest with you. Not terrible damage. Is he slagged? Can't tell. Ow, 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 ow. Come on, evolution. Kick back in, kick back in, kick back, kick back in, kick back in, homie. I can't believe it, man. Hunguska me. It's already over. I can't... No. After all that. Yeah, honestly, if we had more damage, I think maybe specking too much into defense was, was a problem here. More damage would have been definitely better. But anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, drop a like on the video. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. And I'll see you all next one. See ya.